If you're a fan of dark mode on your iPhone or your iPad or your MacBook Pro or any other device you use, you may have realized that the Apple Watch doesn't actually have a built-in dark mode. And other than changing the face, there's not really much you can do about it. So today I wanted to show you how you can make it happen using shortcuts on your iPhone. Basically what we're going to do is a little hack using shortcuts to tell the Apple Watch to switch from one watch face to another watch face like that. So before you start, you wanna make sure you've got a watch face for your daytime and a watch face for your nighttime. I've picked these, but you can use any you like. If you're not sure how to change the faces, just go on there and add a new one. But I'm happy with those two. So this is the one I want at the evening, and this is the one I want during the day. To do this, we're going to use an app called Shortcuts. It is from Apple, so it might already be on your phone, but if not, go to the App Store and download it. If you go into there, it'll come up with this screen. It will just show you the shortcuts that you've made if you've got any. If you haven't, you'll have something that looks like this. So what you wanna do is head over to this one on the bottom called Automation, and we're gonna make personal automation, this one at the top here. So basically, we're gonna ask the iPhone at a certain time of day to change my watch face to a certain face. So I'm gonna say at seven in the morning, and I want that on daily, I want my iPhone to do something. So I'm gonna add an action, and at the top here, I'm gonna search for watch and click the watch app. And then it will say here, set watch face. You've got loads of options, but set watch face is the one we want. And then you're gonna set, set active watch face to face, kick the face. And then you need to pick the one that you have selected for your daytime. Now I remember for mine, it was typograph, which was this one here. So at seven in the morning, I'm gonna change my active watch face to typograph. And then you can press play to watch it do it and it will change it on your watch just to show you what sort of thing it will do. I'm gonna hit next. And then this next screen, it's really important. You want to make sure this is switched off because if that switches on, it will say, do you want to change your watch face every day? And it'll be really annoying and just hit done. And that's the first one done. So that's our daytime watch face. And effectively you're gonna do exactly the same all over again. So press plus, personal automation, time of day. I'm gonna say at um, 22 o'clock, which is 10 o'clock, Every day I want my watch face to change to the night one. So I'm gonna go to here, add action, search for watch again. There we go, just set watch face. I'm gonna set it to the simple watch face, which is the best for nighttime sort of stuff, in my opinion. I'm gonna hit next, turn off ask before, don't ask, and then done. And that's it. So that basically will change your watch face automatically to whatever you want and it will be all like a dark mode. Sadly, you can't change the brightness or anything like that, but that will at least change the watch face to something that just doesn't burn your retinas out when you're checking at night. It's also worth pointing out, if you really like your watch face and don't want to change the style of it, you can just do exactly the same thing, but just have the same watch face and change the color and do that in the automation instead. So that one would be for your nighttime and this one would be for your daytime. So that's totally possible too. So that's a way of getting the Apple Watch to go into a form of night mode. You could take it a bit further and put it into cinema mode and automate things like that as well. But for me, this seems to work okay. Anyway, that is pretty much this whole video. So if you enjoyed it, pop a like. If you loved it, pop a sub. And I will see you all in the next one.